great Boeing 737 UGN common display system. Uh, we'll just talk about screens, some failures of the two computers, the display electronics unit times two, uh, which are basically a symbol generator. Uh, the use of avionics systems interface um, and it's a dynamic 429 uh, signal, analog signals and discrete data to the DEUs, the DEUs and vice versa, having 429 analog and discrete data back to the system. So it's back and forth travel, traffic. Uh, components, you've got two uh, display select panels for the captain first officer. Your engine display panel, two EFAS panels, two DEUs in the main equipment bay, four coax couplers which split the uh, signal from the DEUs to each screen. Uh, you've got six screens, all ident identical and interchangeable, I believe. Uh, two brightness control panels. Got two remote light sensors here, which automatically adjust the brightness. Um, for a dispatch, the captain's inboard screen has to be working one way or another. Fault messages. Okay, so we'll simulate DEU1 has failed, so to call this CB. So automatically it goes on to DEU2. Uh, the message you will get is CDS fault. Um, now instantly you just go to the source select select it, see what's going on. So if you go to two, it's working all on one, all blank. So we know DEU1 has failed. So you go, if you want to do a bit of troubleshooting, go to the CBU, Line select key for maintenance. Uh, CDS. D1. Self test in three minutes. By you not check D or interface. So we know because the CV there's no power to the box. to the U2 now it's letters in uh, current status ok so no D because they cross talk to each other so that's all those uh, in flight there's those previous flights. Could be power change issues. It's not a hard fault. Uh, I will reset this CV. I will just do a display. Take a, a, maybe 30 seconds to put that. Uh, 
ground test. Uh, go into the self test, loop test, optical test, weather radar display test. You can go into the front. This is a funky one. So just checking each colour is uh, working. Obviously, but red, blue, green, stripe. Terrain display test. I don't want to put the weather radar on in here. So. Okay, so. Okay, just look at this. So, location left in board. Just did a loop test for the alley system. Light sensing it's referred to the AMM for what this form is. Outputs are showing that's one. Input activity, uh, brightness control. Message, current status, uh, eight loops not aligned, it's a great. And so in flight, if the crew loses screen, overheats or just fails. So this will go blank. It should. So how you can get that back is by going either. So it doesn't need in flight. It's uh, secondary data for its engine. So you could move this. Put its ND onto the lower screen. This has got screen as a backup. Um, you can put the ND the change. He's it's always got a backup to each screen. So put the screen back on. Um, I don't normally need this in flight, so we're just blanking. And that's, that's basically a summary showing you the DE locations now in the MEC.